All right, today I have a really fun cardio strength workout for you, okay? I'm titling this one a boot camp. So you got it, it's gonna be a little bit more aggressive than the other cardio strength workouts. The formula is also different than what I typically do, all right? So we are gonna have supersets and lots of cardio work, okay? So the supersets are gonna be weighted and those are gonna focus on upper body, abs, and legs, okay? And those are divided out through the workout. In between those supersets, you'll have a lot of cardio work, all right? So we do have one exercise that kind of carries throughout the whole workout that is a walkout. Okay, and so that's gonna be a lot of, there's gonna be a lot of push-ups, but they're spread out. So tomorrow you will feel it, but you will be able to get through the workout, I promise. All right, so this is gonna be 45 minutes, start to finish, that's warm up and cool down included. Okay, and if you have dumbbells, those are the only props you're gonna need for this workout. So I have a heavy pair and a light. I have a pair of 10 pounders and five pounds. Okay, so I would say for your light pair, anywhere from two, to six pounds would be good. For your heavier pair, I would say anywhere from eight to 15 would be good. Okay, so I have five and 10. We're gonna start with a superset in legs. There will be no breaking during that time. Okay, so superset means back-to-back -back exercises. We're gonna get through that, and then we're gonna have a 20 second break before we start some cardio work. All right, so you're gonna follow along with me. I've got my timer set up. You can't see it, but I can, so that way, Got to follow along. All right, we're going to get through it together and get nice and sweaty. All right, so once I set that timer, you're going to grab those heavier weights and we're going to start with a superset in legs. Or actually, I lied. We're going to warm up. Let's warm up first, okay? And then we'll get to that superset in legs. All right, so no timer yet. Let's just start with a really light jump rope. I was getting a little ahead of myself there. I was ready to start this workout. This is going to be a fun one, okay? Absolutely. I've already done it. I loved it. I thought it was great. That's why I'm recording for you today. Now remember, I don't use any music in the background. That's because I don't own the rights to the music. Okay, so that's why you don't have music from me, but you have your music in the background and have that pump it. And we're gonna get through this, all right? Keep it going, really light on those toes. Little imaginary jump rope, get things started. We're here for five. Last four. You've got three, we're coming right into squats. Last two. Good, and bring it to a standstill feet underneath those shoulders. We're gonna bring those arms out, reach those sits bones back. Good, sticking that booty back there. That torso tilts forward as a result of that big reach through those sitting bones. Right at the center of the glute, we reach those back. So it's not a dump of the chest, okay? Core is really tight, feet are planted, okay? All 10 toes are on the floor, and I know you're in sneakers, okay? But I really want you to think about an entire foot on the floor. You are heavier through the heel than you are through the toes. You're here for five. Last four. Kind of come back into step back lunges. Last three. You've got two. Good. Last one. Good. Right from here, we're going to take that right foot back. Bring it back. Left foot. Good. Alternating that step back lunge. Good. That knee bends nice and deep to the floor. Keeping that knee that's in front, just in front of the ankle. Okay, but behind those toes, we don't want it to come in front of the toes. Core is still nice and tight. Just warming everything up, right? Getting it ready for more deeper movement. Nice engagement from that core. Keep it going. Good, four more. Last three. Good, you've got two. Coming into those arms a little bit more. Last one. Good, and bring it all the way up. Let's bring those arms into a field goal position. We're gonna bring those arms down, back up, reach them overhead. Good, field goal. Wrap it down, bring it back, and up. Big stretch, here, and down. Back up, bring them together. Good, really warming up that shoulder. So we've got walkouts, quite a bit of them today. I have not counted, so I'm not gonna throw that number at you. Okay, but it's a lot. We're just gonna keep it going. You'll definitely feel your arms tomorrow. <laughs> There's no question about it. Good, our first superset is gonna be legs. Middle superset is abs, and we're gonna end with those arms, so that'll be our finisher. Woo, good. Last two. Inhale up, good, exhale. Good, last one. Good, and bring it all the way down. All right, just bring it into some easy swimmer hugs, just wrapping those arms around towards the back, getting those fingers to stretch towards the middle of the body, towards that spine, wrap those arms around. Good, once I set that timer, we've got 40 seconds. 
with our first exercise, okay? And that's gonna be followed by another 40 seconds of a different exercise, but all focusing on those legs, okay? So get those heavier weights ready for you. I've got 10 pounders, bring them on out. You're gonna want both. They're gonna be in your hands, okay? I'm gonna set that timer, and we're gonna start right away with single leg squats, all right? So here we go. Grab those weights. Left foot is down, right foot is staggered. You're gonna squat and bring those weights up. Squat, swing it forward. My left foot is heavy, my right toes are light. Okay, good, keep it here. I know those weights are heavy here, they're supposed to feel a little heavier. Okay, keep that core engaged. Reach that left sits bone back, it's a single leg squat. You got 15 more seconds on this side. Good, last 10. We're gonna come right into a curtsy and deadlift, okay? Starting with that curtsy, those weights will hang long by your sides. Last one, all right, right from here. Curtsy, back up, side of that foot, deadlift. Reach it down, hinge it down. Curtsy, back up to that little kickstand with the right foot, hinge it over, stick that left booty back. Curtsy, hinge, good. That right knee lines up with that left heel and that curtsy. Good, flat back hinge on that deadlift. Keep that left knee soft. Stick that left booty back. Last 10 seconds. You got it, keep that left foot nice and heavy. Last five. Woo. Next one, curtsy, hold. Hold it right there, don't come out of your curtsy. Just hold it, you're here for 20 seconds. You just got 10 left, don't go anywhere. We're coming into that right foot. Here we are, last four, you got it. Bring it on up, right foot's down, left foot is staggered now. We've got that swing and that single leg squat. Good, right into that other side. Same movements, okay? Good, keep reaching that right booty back. Focusing on that right side here. Good, you guys, coming right into that curtsy and deadlift. After this, you got it. Last 10 seconds here. Keep breathing. Ooh, I know it's heavy. Good, you got it. All right, from here, curtsy, come up, deadlift. Good, back to that curtsy. That right knee tracks in front of the ankle. That right knee cap tracks with big toe, second toe. Okay, so watch that alignment on that front knee. Curtsy, deadlift. Whew. Last 15 seconds right here. Core is nice and tight, whole time. Weights are hanging long. We're coming up on that curtsy hold. It's coming. All right, next curtsy is a hold. Hold it here, 20 seconds, that's it. Don't let it go, okay, core is super tight. It's holding it all together. Good, you got just 10 seconds left and then we got a 20 second break coming up. Keep breathing. You got it, sip of water coming up. Woo! And bring it all the way up, set those heavy weights down. You will not need them, okay, so set them down, grab water. We're gonna come into our first set of walkouts. All right, you got 10 seconds before we go. Remember, a walk out. We're gonna roll it down, push up, walk it back up. Here we go, feet underneath those shoulders. Walk it down, push up, walk it back up. Good, try to get those legs a little straighter every time. Now, walk outs are gonna separate all of our cardio moves, okay? So, high metabolic demand here. We want to keep that heart rate going. All right, no breaks. We got it. This first set of walkouts is your longest set. So the walkouts are purposely designed like a drop set. Okay, but today we're doing it with time rather than reps. Get that chest all the way to the floor. Good. So this first set is one minute and 40 seconds, but you're already down. So 45 seconds left. Good, and walking it up. 
Next time we do the walkouts, it'll be a minute and 30 seconds. So it's gonna get shorter every time. Just don't stop moving. If you need to come to your knees for that push-up, that is an option. Come to your knees, okay? Last 20 seconds. Keep it going. Woo! Coming up on a 20 second break. And then we're gonna hit our first cardio push. One minute cardio exercises. Woo! All right, you guys, 20 second break. Grab water. Our first exercise is gonna be box climbers. So you're gonna be back down in that plank position. Hands underneath your shoulders. We're gonna jack it out. Jump the feet up to the palms, out and back in. Open, up, out and back in. Here we go, let's hit it. Open, up, back, in. Open, up, back, in. So making a little box with those legs. You can speed it up. Good, really push that speed. We're coming right up on those walkouts, no break, no break after this. One minute and 30 of walkouts. You got it. Keep it going. We just got 20 seconds left on this one. Good, keep that weight in your hands. Woo. You got it, don't collapse through the shoulder. Keep everything strong. Woo. Last 10 seconds. Walk it up, all right, coming right into walkouts. So here we go, let's hit it. Walk it down, push up, walk it back. Good, down, out, push up, walk it back. Woo! All right, 20 second break, coming up after this one. Good, without that music, you're gonna hear me. Breathing hard. This is a high, a high metabolic demand for this one. Whew. Not much room for chit chat. Whew. Here we go. 45 seconds left. You got it, just don't stop moving. Almost there, guys. Less than 30 seconds. Almost there. Woo. 10 seconds left. You got this. water. All right. Next cardio exercise. Mm. We got squat, punch to crisscross jump. So wide squat, punch, punch, cross it in, punch, punch, cross it in. Okay, here we go. Starting nice and wide, punch, punch, crisscross. Alternate your leading arm and your crossing leg. Good, you guys, excellent. Good, right into walkouts. Going right back to those walkouts. We got 30 seconds left right here. Whew. Snap those arms out and in. Good, you guys. Excellent. Last 20 seconds. Good. You got 10. Coming right back to those walkouts. One minute, 20 seconds we have. Woo! All right. Back to those walkouts. No break. Walk it down. Push up. Bring it back. 
nice and simple. It's not complicated, right? It's just high demand on the body. Lots of repetition. The muscles are going to get tired. We're definitely breaking down the muscles today. So after this, make sure you refuel with some protein. Some lean protein. That's what your muscles are going to need. Keep it going. We got 35 seconds left. That's it. 20 second break is waiting for us. Remember, dropping to your knees on that push up is always an option if need be. Otherwise, you just want to keep walking it out. Let's keep going. Woo, last five seconds. All right, guys, grab that water. Grab that water. Whew. Towel off. Our next one, what do we got? Mm. Grab your weights, heavy weights. Bring them down on the floor. Together, we're gonna hop over them, okay? Here we go. Whoo! Little hop over those weights. If you want one weight rather than two to hop over, that's fine. Make your hop nice and light. Lots of focus. I don't want you tripping over your weights. Okay. Whew. We're one minute on this exercise, but you're already halfway through. Back to those walkouts. A minute ten.
Good, come on up. Set those weights to the side so they're not in the way. Get your mat out of the way. Back to those walkouts. Round it down. Walk it out. Push up. Okay, no stopping. Okay, we got that mat right out of the way because we got a 20 second break waiting for us. Okay, so we gotta get there. You just got 40 seconds left. And keep it going. Whew. You're gonna be real good at walkouts after this workout. Really good. Whew, last 20 seconds. Don't stop. Keep it going. Whew, last 10. water, towel off, and we're getting really close to that next superset. Here we go, wide squats. Next cardio move, okay? We're almost there to that next superset. It's a wide squat, okay? Curl to the left, I mean right, curl to the left, okay? And then we're gonna jump in. Okay, so you're, turn, you're rotating, rotate, jump it in. Forgot what we were doing there for a second. Good, twist through the waist. It's a twist, a twist, and then a jump in. A twist, a twist, it's a curl. Through those obliques, okay? Little side crunch, and in. Twist, twist, in, yes. Twist, twist, in, twist, twist. Really focus on that waist. Last 20 seconds here. So it goes fast. Find that really deep bend through the knees. Good, last 10 seconds. Coming right back into those walkouts, but we're under a minute with them now. 50 seconds, last one. All right, back to that walkout. Round it down, all the way out. Push up, bring it back. Last 30 seconds. So you notice that it gets shorter and shorter. Every time you may not feel like it, right? So the body's getting more tired, but that's the idea. Pushing through. You got it, guys, you got it. Last 10 seconds here. Water, grab that water. All right, here we go. Our next superset is on us now. So, abs, grab your mat. Okay, that mat's gonna come out on the floor. And you grab those light weights. All right, now, same formula. Supersets, back-to-back -back exercises, no break, okay? So we're gonna work on a dead bug. You're gonna start on your back. Arms up over the chest with those light weights. Legs in tabletop. My knees are over my hips. My knees are four inches apart. All right, it's gonna be right arm, left leg. Back. And then left arm, right leg, let's hit it. Back. Right arm, left leg, zip it up. Left arm, right leg, zip it up. Okay, we're in it, guys. We're 40 seconds right here. Good, keep it going. Now, we do have 20 second holds coming up. Okay, so the formulas, or the timing formula is a little different than it was on the leg superset. I want you to think about that belly button real tight. That diagonal connection through the body. Your opposite shoulder to opposite leg, that connection through the torso. Good, on the next one, you're gonna hold right arm, left leg out. Hold them there. Now pulse them up one inch. Up, up, up but you're pulsing from the belly button. Contracting, lifting it up one inch. It's very small and controlled. We're right back to that dead bug. Whew. Bring it in. Left arm, right leg, and back. Right arm, left leg, back. 
Good. Nice control through the middle of the body. Opposite arm, opposite leg. Good, you guys. Our next hold is going to be right arm, left leg. I'm sorry, right leg, left arm. Whew. You got it. Control, control that core. Keep those ribs closed. Keep that corset tight. All right, you guys, next one. Left arm, right leg, hold. Pulse it up. One inch up, 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 up. Whew. Tight, nice control. Good, don't let that low back over arc, okay? Then you're gonna load the low back. We don't wanna do that. Keep your ribs closed. Coming right back to that full dead bug. All the way in, right arm, left leg, and up. Left arm, right leg, and up. You got it. Don't stop. Reach and in. Reach and in. Zip it up. Find that cable cord and pull those two limbs back up to start. Good. Reel it in. Our next hold is coming up. It's both arms, both legs. If you need to drop your weights, drop your weights, okay? You don't have to have them. If you're overarching that low back, you're too, too weighted. Okay, you got it. Woo, both arms and legs, hold. No pulse, just a hold. Hold for 20 seconds, you got it. Pull that core nice and tight. Woo, don't let it go. You got it, you got it, I know it burns. Just breathe. You got it, we're almost there. 20 second break, coming up. Woo, bring it in. Oh my goodness, all right, set those weights down. Grab water if you need it, because we're coming right back into those walkouts. And since we're starting a new set of cardio exercises, it's one minute and 40 seconds on those walkouts, okay? So, hitting it strong. We're starting strong. Here we go. Walk it out. Whoo! Right back. I feel those abdominals. They are tired. But I want you guys to keep pushing through. Okay, chest to the floor. You know what to do. We're almost there. Guys, we're already more than halfway through on this workout. You passed that second superset already. We only have one more superset that's gonna end this entire workout. We're getting it done, getting it done. All right, guys, under a minute left, under a minute. Keep it going, nice and strong. You know, make some noise. It helps me. That's why you constantly hear me going, woo, because it helps. It helps you get through it. Let out some steam. Let out some energy. Whew. I know you're strong or you wouldn't be here right now. You wouldn't have picked this workout. So stay with me. We're almost through it. We're getting through it together. Guys. 15 seconds. That's it. I know this is your longest set. Just remember that once this one is over, they just get shorter. Woo! Okay, water, nice water, grab water. So good. All right, that first one minute cardio coming up. Mm. This one's a little bit more strength, a little bit more isometric. Grab your mat, okay? We're gonna come down on the mat. Wide push up to a lift, all right? So feet are wide, arms are out, bring them in halfway. Press it up, push up, come down, lift the arms and the legs, engage the glute. Bring it back, push it up. Okay, so a double cross, a lift, and then a push up. Find that little balloon underneath your belly button Okay, and inflate up on that push-up. Give some breath to that back rib cage. Breathe into it, lift it up. Dome right between those shoulder blades. Lift, lift up out of that shoulder girdle. Engage the glute on that lift at the bottom. Tighten, 
Try to get the tops of the thighs off the mat. We're almost there, guys. 10 seconds left. Last one. All right, you guys come right on up. Back to those walkouts, no break. All right, here we go. Walk it out. Push up. You got it. Whew, we're almost there. That 20 second break is waiting for you at the end. Let's go. Let's get there. You feel those hamstrings tomorrow too. Whew, lots of stretching, lots of flexibility right here. It's loosening up the warmer you get, right? We're really warm now. There's no question about that. All right, you guys, last 35 seconds. Water's coming. We're getting to that water. You got a 20 second break coming up in 20 seconds. Don't stop, guys. Remember, those knees on that push up are always an option. Just don't quit on me. Whew. You got it, guys. Woo, grab water. All right, here we go. Next cardio push. Where are we at? What do we got? Okay. Squat the front kick. I love this one. All right. Underneath the shoulders with those feet. Squat, front kick. Squat, front kick. Okay, here we go. Let's hit it. Squat, kick. We're going to lead with that heel on that kick. We're going to find that squat every time. Nice and deep. Reaching those sit bones back for the heels. Kick with some force. Lead with that heel. Good, you guys. You got it. Core is tight. It's really engaged now. We're coming back on those walkouts. Minute and 20. Okay, no break. We're gonna get it done. 20 more seconds here. Just keep it going. Good, you guys. Kick with some force. Good. Get out that aggression. No more walkouts, right? No more. We're almost there. Five seconds left. Whew. Last one. Straight to those walkouts, guys. Let's hit it. Round it down. Out. Push up. Good. Don't stop. Hey, just remember, less breaks, we get through this faster. Under a minute. Under a minute, guys. Almost there. Woo. Make some noise. Make some noise. Grunt. Push it up. You got it. That way you don't have to listen to me. <laughs> You can listen to yourself. Last 30 seconds, guys. Whew. After a while, right? The body knows. It's conditioned. We're conditioning it. It knows the movement. It knows the pattern. Whew. Last 10 seconds. Get that chest to the floor. Woo! Last one. All right, guys, take that break. Take that break. Woo! All right. Next at one minute. Let's see. What do we got? Aha. Uh -huh. All right. Hands and knees. We're going to be in a hover. Okay, hover position. So, toes turned under. Hover those knees one inch. Right leg kicks out to the side. Left. Jumping jack and in. Back to the hover. Right. Left. Jack. Four point hover. Right. 
left, jack, back to the four point hover. So your knees are bending in at the end of that jumping jack. Good, keep that low back nice and flat, core is tight. Almost there guys, 20 seconds. Good, keep pulling those knees under the hips. That core working hard. The last 10 seconds, right into those walkouts. We got a minute 10. Woo. All right, come on up. Right into it, round it down. Walk it out, push up, bring it back. Woo. Woo, my hands are getting sweaty, huh? Guys, less than 45 seconds to go. We're almost there. Don't stop. 30 seconds left. Whew. Chest to the floor every time. All the way. Full range of motion. Woo, guys. 15 seconds. You can do this. Ooh, I'm telling you what I'm telling me. I'm telling me too. Good, you guys. I think we got one more. All right, water it up. Towel off. Woo. Next minute. What do we got? Let's see. Mm. That's some good stuff. Okay, here we go. You're gonna be in a squat. Okay, hold that squat. Here we go, we're gonna hit it. Right leg, left leg, hop. Right leg. Left leg, hop. So you're always coming back to that squat, okay? Nice stability through the core. Okay, that core is engaged. Nice drive through the toes. Some power into that hop. Good. You got 30 seconds left right here. That sweat dripping in your eyes is in mine. Good, you guys dance it out. We're almost there. Straight into those walkouts again. This time we're down to a minute on those bad boys. All right, 10 seconds here. Woo, last one. All right, walkouts guys, let's hit it. Round it down, all the way out, push up. 20 second break is waiting for you guys on that other end. Woo! Good, you guys. Halfway. Woo! Keep it going. Don't quit. We're so close. Woo, you got less than seven minutes left to this whole workout. Woo. All right, you guys, last 10 seconds. Let's get one more out. Woo. All right, water. Grab that water. All right. Next minute exercise. Sky punches. Okay, so right, we're gonna be in a squat-like position, or demi-squat. Right hand down to left toes and up. Left hand, right toes, punch it up. Alternating sky punches. Whew. Try to land light on those feet. We're almost there, guys. You got that walkout coming up, but you know what? 
It's the last set. It's the last set of walkouts, guys. Woo, we did it. We're almost there. Less than 30 seconds on this. Find that deep squat every time. Here we are, 15 seconds. I know your quads are burning. Don't stop. Fight past that burn. Fight past, five seconds. Woo! Last one. Woo, straight to walk out, guys. This is the last set. Make them strong. Slow them down if you have to, but get them done, okay? This is it. Thirty seconds. Whew. That break's coming up, guys. Twenty seconds to that break. Whew. Breathing through it. We got one more in our body. One more. Grab that water. Oh my goodness, guys. Last super set, biceps. Whew. Okay, here we go. So you got 25 seconds left still. You're gonna grab your light weights. Well, okay, let's start with heavy. So if you have 10 pounders, that's where I'm gonna start. Probably gonna drop them for the second set, but I'm gonna start with that 10, all right? Woo, we're gonna start with bicep curls. Feet underneath the shoulders, okay? Now, they're gonna be hammer curls to start. So we're gonna isometrically hold, okay? My right arm's gonna drop. We're in it, guys, so hit it with me. Left arm drops, okay? So we're alternating the drop, or the curl, while the other arm patiently waits in the isometric hold. So everything is working. You got it. We're coming up on a bicep curl with an external rotation. So I will show you that one. That'll be another 40 seconds. We're gonna alternate again. Or actually, it's, it's both arms, so we're not alternating. That one will be both together. Woo. All right, next one. Both arms drop. Okay, palms are facing up. Bicep curl and externally rotate down. So I, that first one was horrible. Bicep curl, 90-90. Externally rotate from the shoulder. Bring it back and down. Up. Rotate. In and down. Yes. Control. Find that swivel from the top of the shoulder. You got 10 seconds right here. Hold it strong. Core is super tight. It's helping me. It's helping my arms move. All that stability. Last one. Hold your bicep curl. Hold. Isometric hold. 20 seconds right here, guys. 20 seconds. Don't let it go. Core is tight. Shoulder blades are wrapping your ribs. Ribs are closed. We got it. We're in a little demi-squat. Good. Breathe through it. Back to the hammer curl. Here we go. Okay? 90-90. Right arm. Left arm. Right arm. Yes, left arm. Okay? If you need to switch your weights, switch your weights. Hang on to this as long as you can. That bicep curl with that external rotation is coming up, okay? That bicep curl stops at that 90-90 bend at the elbow. Woo! We got it. Last 10 seconds here. Guys, this is the end of the workout, okay? This is it. No, it's almost over. You got less than a minute left. All right, guys. Okay, 90-90. Both drop. They come up. Externally rotate. Down. Up. Externally rotate. Guys, I'm changing my weights. I'm changing my weights. But I'll bring them back for that hold. External. Down. Up. External from the shoulder. Swivel. Open those doors. Last 10 seconds here. 
almost there guys, almost there, that 90, or that isometric hold is coming up. I'm gonna grab my heavier weights, here we go. Hold that bicep curl, hold, hold and breathe. Don't let it go. Good, don't jam those elbows into your waist. Keep them separated, you got it. Less than 10 seconds. We got five, four, three, two, woo, guys, all done. So strong. That's it. I'm going to give you a little cool down. Grab water. Towel off. Those arms are on fire. Whew. Mm -hmm. All right, you guys. Nice, easy swimmer hugs. Same way we ended our warm-up. I'm going to start that cool down. Whew. And just breathe. Let that body start to relax. Bring that heart rate down. All right. <laughs> I'm a mess. Hopefully you guys got nice and sweaty too. I'm sure. With those walkouts, right? You can't get around it. It's kind of a given. Last four. Then you got three. Last two. All right. Since we worked those arms so much, we're going to start out with those arms. Okay. So I'm going to wrap those shoulder blades around the ribs. Core is really tight. I'm going to take that right arm nice and low across the chest. And I'm just going to give it a gentle pull. Make sure that shoulder is not all the way up by your ear. Whew, that we've got that shoulder blade drop down the back. I'm just giving it a nice gentle press across the chest, opening up the back of the shoulder for four, last three, and last two. Good, release that right arm. Let's take that left arm, same thing. Make sure that shoulder blade is wrapping the ribs. Bring that left arm across the body. Gentle pull across. Good, holding it here, breathing. Last four, you've got three, last two. Good, let that shake loose. Let's bring both arms up and overhead. Now my left hand is gonna take my right wrist and I'm gonna try to pull that right arm up and out of the waistline. So I'm taking a little side bend, but I'm also actively pulling on that right wrist. Big reach, try to rip that arm out of the waist. Good, holding it here for four, last three, last two. Good, bring it all the way back. Right arm, right hand takes left wrist, and we're gonna pull that left arm out of the waist. Gentle little pull. Good, nice job, you guys, today. That was not an easy workout, hence the boot camp name. That's why, all right, it's a lot, it was a lot of demand on the body, a lot of back to back, very little breaks. Good, bring that back to center. Now, keeping the arms overhead, my left hand is gonna take my right elbow, and I'm gonna reach those fingers down the center of my spine. Okay, really reaching as far down that back as possible. Holding it here for four, three, last two. Good, release that, keep those arms up there. Right hand takes left elbow, same thing. Gentle nod of the chin, reach those fingers down the back. Still breathing for four, last three, last two. Good, let that go. Whew, give those arms a nice little roll. All right, now grab that mat. Do a quick little stretch through the legs and spine. All right, we're gonna bring ourselves down onto our knees. Our right foot's gonna come forward into that staggered stance. And my right knee is gonna track just to the center of that right foot bed, okay? So just in front of the ankle. I'm gonna grab my left foot with my left hand. And as I press my left foot into my left palm, I'm pressing that foot into my hand. I'm gonna also curl my tailbone or my pelvis under me, okay? So think about like a dog, sad dog, right? They curl their tail underneath their body. That's what I want you to do now. Curl that tail under you. You're gonna get a bigger stretch on the front of that left quad. You're here for four, last three, last two. Good, release that foot. Now we're gonna take that left arm and we're gonna take it to the outside of the right knee, okay? I'm going to take my right arm and I'm going to look up and away. I'm going to twist away from that knee and look at those right fingertips. Little spinal twist. Also releasing the hip a little bit for four. Last three, two. Good. Bring it all the way back to center. Let's switch those legs out. Left foot forward, right foot back. Same thing. Left knee tracks just in front of the ankle. I'm going to reach back and grab my right foot with my right hand. 
I'm going to press my right foot into my right palm as I curl my tail under my body. I'm going to feel that right quad really stretch. Holding it here for four. Last three, two, Good, release that foot. Now I'm going to take my right arm, I'm going to take it to the outside of that left knee, and my left arm is going to reach up and away. I'm going to look at my left fingers, little spinal twist, releasing that right side. Good, you're here for four, three, last two. Bring it all the way back to center. Bring both feet under the body nice and flat. Knees are going to stay soft as we hang down over those legs. And we're going to inhale and stack that spine one vertebrae at a time, all the way back up to standing. And guys, you are all set. Nice job. Nice job. That was not an easy workout. It was not meant to be an easy workout. Okay, guys? So, awesome job. Way to get through it. You'll feel it tomorrow, right? But that's a good feeling. It's a feeling of you just worked hard and you just kicked your own butt, right? So, nice job, you guys and I will see you next time. Any comments you have for me, please leave them below the video. I am always here to answer your questions and I love hearing your comments, good and bad. Also, you can find me on Instagram at JessBeFit. It's the same exact name, so I'm easy to find. You can always write me there. All right, guys, I'll see you next time. Awesome job.